<sighs> okay. We are on... I don't know what we're doing. We're spraying a cock with water. How about that? You know, get a cock wet, get money. Right? That's what that is. Oh my gosh, that's literally what that is. You get a cock wet, and you get, you get money. <laughs> that's just, wow. I have no word, I have no words for that. That's just amazing. That really is just amazing. Starting off, that's the best, you know, I think that's the best way to start off a video. Is you getting your cock wet. Well, just wet cock, gold coin. I, I can't complain. I mean, you could. You very well could. But you'd be wrong. Maybe you, you'd be a dumb faggot. Anyway, what are we doing? I know what we're doing. We're getting coconuts. Because you gotta shove coconuts in an egg. I don't know, you, you gotta like put this coconut. Or is it a watermelon? I forget. I'm pretty sure this is a coconut. Um, you give it to an egg and you get a dinosaur. You know. If we're, let's just be literal and all. Like all the way. You know, I've tried doing 100 coins on this uh, shine. It doesn't work out, don't do it. You get close, but you won't get it. Unless you get the line of blue coins that are like, went uh, through there on the, off that jump rope there. I never know how to get it. I'll have to show it some other time, but I just want to make a, I'm just trying to make a quick video before I go to bed. And I really wanted to play this game because I haven't recorded f for, well, like this game, and really actually had like an actual recording session for about probably a week or two. It's been a little bit. I don't know. So it just feels good to come back and do it again. And I wanted to play this game because the summer is coming, it's May. Summer is pretty much right around the corner. I think this is a summer title. I love, I'm just I need to play it, and it's my favorite game ever. So why would I not play it? So Yoshi's for the um, you have to do it for that one foot imprint there. The blue coin's only in that foot imprint on this shine. Uh, otherwise, it just doesn't. Ha it's not there. Then the bees, of course. And I would recommend just using Yoshi for that this blue one that I just got on this tree. It makes it easier. After that, Yoshi's a useless piece of fucking shit. Especially for where did we get the blue birds? I think so. This is where the level opens up and you can do a lot of stuff and a lot of things are acquirable. Yeah. How about that? Um, like the rocket to get that blue coin that eludes the cell. I think that's right. Oh, probably the right word. Who knows? Someone could tell me. Or no one could tell me. No one's gonna tell me. Let's be real here. No one's gonna tell me. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Oh! Ooh. Oh, that was clutch right there. Hey, okay, let's get it from right here. Gotcha. And we got all the coins. Nice. I haven't played in a while, so I'm surprised I'm doing so well. I'll go ahead and get this. So we can unlock it everywhere. Plus, it'll actually help for some what we're doing. And we're getting red coins now. I gotta check if I got the blue coins under here. Uh, blue coins. Blue coin. This is just one. Do they get it under here? Bitch, camera? 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 Hello? Yeah, I did. I thought I did. I just gotta double check. The fuck off. How many? Oh, wait, are we done? Oh, we have one more. I don't even know where it is. To be honest, I don't remember where it is. So, we have a blue coin out there somewhere. Shit, I don't know. Holy shit. 
Shoot, I don't know. Oh well. Right now we have to focus on getting red coins. Ugh. That's one thing I can say about this game is they took red coins and instead of just hiding them throughout the, the each level, they just have them in specific sections or whatever. Um, we have to do like time trials in uh, each each world, and usually more than once. Almost always, actually always, because there's a secret. Every each secret level has a red coin time attack thing. And yeah, they way overused red coins in this game. Like, wow, it's pretty bad. That's one thing that's kind of disappointing. But a hey, not a big deal to me. Still love it all the same. So there's two in this one that suck because they're with the stupid school of fish that are fucking pain in the ass. And then you got these ones that just want to suck you off and give you head. Like that. Gosh. God damn it. Little cunts. Come on. Come on. Come on now. And the thing is, these red coins, they, they'll they clip in the, the ground. Or rocks. As you just as you can see. So it's frustrating. There we go. But there's only two of those, so. The rest are out throughout this coral reef, which basically just looks like big rock with, I guess there's coral there. It looks, uh, it looks all right. It's nice. I was just saying it, it's more like, a, it's just a big rock with a texture and then a bunch of other little things throughout, throughout it. I don't know. I, I'm not sure where I was going with that shit. But my point is... I don't have a point, Rip. I never have points. Well, we're almost done with this one. Okay, come on. I don't know, it's just, this is pretty, this is a relaxing one. It's just slow and mellow. There's not really much you do, you just, it's all about swimming and taking a look around this little area that's not used otherwise. I think it's kind of nice. And the music is, it's just, all the music in this game is very relaxing, just very nice. The tropical themes, I mean, I love tropical themes. Like, tropical flavors are good. I, I like, like, I like fruit punch. Um. Um. Uh, Mount White Label Mountain Dew is my favorite uh, uh, label series flavor because it has the tropical citrus. It's just really nice. That was weird. That was a weird drop, but it's just really nice. I just tropical stuff is nice. You know, in a tropical area like Hawaii or something. Oh, is that tropical? I don't know. Just it's nice. How can you not like it? Yeah, just it's relaxing and fun. I don't know. Yeah, no, you know, if you know, you know. If you don't get it, you just don't get it. Do we ever get that gold bird? I think we did. I think I showed a Yoshi exploit. Glit, eh, more, eh, not exploit, glitch. Whatever, let's top off this world. Oh. With the grapefruit method, you know? But no, I'm feeling pretty good, though. The weather's getting nicer. Been out in the sun, just everything's going pretty good, I think. It just feels good. It's a good time of year. Summer is usually always the best time of year. It's just full of fun and relaxing. And you always feel great because the sun's always out and you can always be outside being active. You know, especially where I live. I live in the Pacific Northwest, so it's always raining and shit um, when it's not summer. And even during summer, like June, you'll still get rain days. But after June, you, typically in July and August, it's most pretty much sunny all the time. Well, that's an interesting spot. I've never gotten them before. I've gotten them there before, but not specifically right there, I don't think. 
Oh, yeah. The last blue coin. Where the fuck is it? Oh! Oh, I know which one it is. Oh, I know what it is. I'm pretty sure I didn't get it yet, did I? Because I always forget about it, because this blue coin, you have to take a... I'm pretty sure I didn't do it yet. You have to take a fruit. I don't... I think it has to be from this table, if I remember correctly. Can we pick up a fruit? Holy shit. But I think it has to be from that table, because I'm pretty sure you can't use coconuts for some reason. Or maybe you can, and I just forget about it. Or the the coconuts aren't on the tree. Uh, like I I want I like to do it right away, but you can't. I don't. I just never do. I always forget about this one, kind of. So yeah, but there's this thing up here, and you put a fruit in it, and you get a blue coin. Yep. And that's the last one in this level. Yup, we're all done. And I'm tempted to, after we get the shine, to go on th and just completely 100% this level, but... We gotta save... S I wanna try to save going to all the levels throughout the whole playthrough so we don't just forget about a level completely, because we'll never come back here. Like, it's completely... Oh, wait, there's a 100 coin shine, that's right. But, still. Hmm, I guess. At the same time, the next shine could be either really quick or really long. Like, it's... Oh, what the hell am I doing up here? Boy. Girl. And that's all options right there. Boom. Get triggered. Today. Eh. I don't know. I shouldn't... I shouldn't make only 11 minute videos. I should at least go a little longer. Maybe I will do the next shine. But we're not doing 100 coins. 100 coins is gonna have to wait. But maybe I will go ahead and just do it. Because we'll come back for the 100 coins. Yeah, let's do it. Doing it. So we're going to get this last shine. And then that new coin tier will be done later. Uh, Yep, that sounds good. Just trying to think about how I want to play this. Uh, what I want to do. Get a little bit of variety, you know. And then just mix it up. I always play it the same way. Well, actually, not really. Usually I play it... Um, I, I play the game differently every time, but they're the same. Right? So I play it a different way. I have a few different ways I play the game, and I play a different version of one every time. I don't know if that makes sense. And I've played this game so many times now. Now this one really sucks, because you have to get this big watermelon all the way down to the plank. And across that boardwalk there to the juice stand. And, yeah, it's really annoying. Because, uh, these red little, these red dickheads will, uh, go ahead and fling it up in the air and ruin your chances completely. They are a pain, so just go, I mean, just do what I just did there, it's the easiest way to get it down here, and then you just go ahead and roll it across the, the battlefield if you will, and just be careful, try to do it quick, well, camera, and if you see those red things start to pop up, just, just go, 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 go. Um, make sure to squirt them and you should be good, and then squirt them. Don't let them get near it. Doesn't matter. No. Don't you dare. This is actually the best, one of the best runs I've ever done of this fucking shine. I'm not gonna let it get ruined right now. And if it goes in the water, by the way, it's gone. You have to go back. And it does respawn anytime it disappears, so. Like, right now, it should be golden. Like, if you got it here, you should have it. Uh, as long as you can slowly kind of just get it across this board. You know, this little boardwalk or whatever. I don't know what the fuck. This little bridge. It's called. Or it's not really. I don't, just this little fucking. Mmm. This little walkway, okay? Just get across the walkway. Use your flood if you have to. It, it makes it a little less jerky. It makes it more smooth and slow and controlled, kind of. 
compared to this jerky shit that almost gets it in the water. You know, just be careful. Let's go ahead and squirt it. It doesn't matter if you squirt it. You squirt all you want. And then you take it right here. Boom. Done. That was like the smoothest run I could have ha wished for. And they juice that shit up and give you a shot. For some reason, they, they're holding a shine sprite hostage for watermelon. Well, of course, of course it's a black piano. Okay, let's just be real here. Let's just... I mean, look at this. You, you, you're required to take the biggest watermelon. They're having a watermelon contest. And who's the judge? And who gives you a grand prize for the biggest watermelon? A black guy. Ironically, no. There's nothing ironic about that shit. That was on purpose. Let's be real. There's even more racism in this game, too. And I'm gonna... I'll, w you'll see it. I'll show you later. Matter of fact, since we're on the topic, I'll show you now. I'll show you right damn now. I am triggered by this. Not only do you take watermelon to that black piano. Mmm. And, ooh. He's the judge of the watermelon contest. Of course, he wants the best, juiciest watermelon. Of course. But not only that, but come over here to this island. And guess what? Guess what? There's another black one. And you know what he says? And not only that, but first of all, they're like the token black guys. There's like no other black uh, pianos throughout the whole entire fucking game. Those are the, like... Coming to mind, those are like the only goddamn two. And guess what? First of all, get a one up. The second of all, talk to this man. And he says, I was shipwrecked and washed up here three years ago. I often think about the far shore, but I can't swim. I've never left this little island. That's just awful. This guy, they put a black piano alone, isolated, on an island because of a shipwreck and get you. Why can't he get back to shore? Oh, because he can't swim. Do you see that shit? Do you see what they did there? Don't tell me you're not triggered the fuck out by that. Watermelon... Watermelon judge? Black. Alone on an island and can't swim to shore? Black. You're not telling me that's coincidence. You're not telling me that that was an inside joke with the developers when they were making the game. You're not telling Get out of my face with that. That was absolutely intentional, and it's awesome. <laughs> it's fucking hilarious. <laughs> I'm not... Holy shit. It's gotta be the funniest thing in the world. Actually, isn't there? Oh, there is another black guy over here. Oh, there is some black. Okay, I, I, you know what? I was wrong. There is some more. It sure is dark. Boy. 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 Wait, what do you say? Are all the cities dark? Boy. Just, just. It, it speaks for itself. It speaks for itself. Holy shit. Oh, fuck. Anyway, we're done. I, I wasted so much time with that stupid. It was. Oh. Uh.